Hello, it's Tad Walker here with another drinks review. Not an energy drink this time. This one was requested um, for me to do by my good friend Christopher Foster. And it was a couple of months ago, but I'm quite slow working. So today I will be reviewing Skittles Milkshake. Now at first thought, this is great. Who doesn't like Skittles? And I'm a big milkshake fan. But then when you think about it, Skittles milkshake doesn't actually sound like the most delicious thing that you can drink. I'm apprehensive. I like my milkshake to be quite thick and quite gloopy. Because it should be, in my opinion. If you taste a Skittle and then imagine that as a milk... No, this doesn't seem right to me. So it's been sitting in my um, fridge for about two months. You know what? I'll just check the sell by day on it. Oh no, fuck it. It'll be fine. <sighs> right, well, straight away it's pink. You know what? It's sort of mauve. Let me just... Uh... Mauve. Good, isn't it? And um, it's got one of those sports caps on it, you know, just in case you're doing sports and you're like, oh, whew, that fucking 100 meter hurdles was uh, a bit tiresome. Let's just have a fucking Skittles milkshake. Oh, yeah, that's great. Why they put sports caps on things like this? I don't understand it. I'm still going to drink it through it though. In for a penny, in for a pound, or as the Chinese say, if I buy apple ha. That was pretty racist. Oh, I forgot to smell it. That smells like Skittles. I can taste the rainbow just in the smell. And usually that would be great. If I smelled another drink and it smelled like Skittles, I'd be like, oh, it smells like Skittles, that's really nice. I, I do really like Skittles, they're up there. But, as a milkshake, there's something weird going on. And I don't have to be a detective to work it out. Oh, fucking hell, I almost missed my mouth then, did you see that? Something very weird is going on. It's like you've had a handful of just random Skittles and you put them in. Flavoured milk is almost certainly strawberry and it has a sort of more strawberry milkshake undercurrent to it. Or strawberry flavoured milk rather I should say. More than a strawberry Skittle. And straight away you sort of taste a combination of the purple black currant Skittle and a little bit of the orange-orange skittle. Lemons in there as well though. It's weird. They've actually done really well to um, to blend the flavours all together. I think a lesser experienced tongue would say that it tastes like all of them, but the the milk is definitely a strawberry flavoured milk with the flavourings built on top. It's not thick at all either. It's um, it's quite thin, um, like any other drink. Look at that, just regular, you know. That's still some lemonade in. No. No, this is fucking strange. It's Skittles in a drink. If you were looking for Skittles in a drink, this is it. This is a... But if you... Don't drink this. Why have they made this? I can understand them making fucking Mars milkshake and Gab Galaxy Caramel milkshake, even fucking 
Snickers and Twix milkshakes. I get that, it's chocolate. Chocolate goes in a milkshake well. I'm not dissing strawberry milkshake, but this is strawberry, blackcurrant, lime, lemon and orange milkshake. This is not gonna work. That's like putting strawberry, chocolate, banana milkshake all together. They're great on their own. But then again, back in the day, one of my favourite childhood um, memories was going to a place in Mould called Benelli's. Big up if you remember that. And they used to do milkshakes um, of every flavour. And it was there that I had a lime milkshake for the first time. Gentleman of around eight years old. Um, sitting there with a the lime milkshake going, this is the fucking tits, Grandma. You know, the one that smells like Jamaican jerk sauce. And I was like, this is great. I like unusual flavours, and I like what I like. Personally, an orange milkshake, I wouldn't think works. A blackcurrant milkshake, I wouldn't think works. A lemon milkshake, I wouldn't think works. Strawberry? Yeah, it's a given. And most people, let's face it, wouldn't think a lime milkshake works either. Maybe it doesn't. I like it. That's my choice. So why would you take five flavours, four of which don't work, one of which, which is a proven method, ram them all in the same fucking drink and then market it? This is essentially what they've done with Skittles Milkshake. It's tricky as well, and I'll tell you, it's a deceitful drink. Don't trust this. If it says, oh, um, Tad, oh shit, I forgot my wallet. Can I lend a fiver? I'll give it back to you on Tuesday. Don't believe it's lies. This will never give you your fiver back. Don't celebrate Hanukkah with Skittles milkshake. And I'll tell you why it's trickery, thiefly as you will, sleuthish. Um, it's because it tastes like something familiar that you like, e.g. Skittles. But this is not Skittles, it's just Skittle brand. If I was to take the wrapper off, look at this right now. At the moment you're thinking, oh Skittles milkshake, that's not too bad. But if for example it was, miscellaneous white drink and you drank it suddenly it feels like you might have found it on the side of a road don't get me wrong for road bottle leftover find it's quite nice you could have done a lot worse you could have done a lot worse But for buying in a supermarket for a price of around about £1.39 a bottle, 400 mil. Yep. Don't go there, it's weird. Right. No, no, no. Fucking minging! Check that shit out. Subscribe button. Mm. Dickheads. Hang on. Leave comments as well. Comments is. I should have wrote comments on the other side, shouldn't I? Imagine comments is on the other side. Subscribe, yeah. Comments. Fucking. Jacqueline penis. Quality channel.